will Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach release. In this video, we will discuss the possible release windows of Security Breach. Remember to take this with a grain of salt as the game could be delayed again, or, and it's also just a theory and a possible release time based off of logic and such. Let's get started. Before we get started, about 50% of you watching this video right now are not subscribed, so be sure to subscribe for more Five Nights at Freddy gameplay and theories. Also, if I miss anything important in this video or you have your own comment, or if you have your own theory, comment down below. So as we know, Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach was to be released already, but due to the virus it was delayed like most other games. But with FNAF Security Breach, we have a three month period where it will be exclusive to PC and PlayStation, the PS4 and the PS5. So this brings in the question, will it still have this exclusivity? I believe yes, here's why. So they've already made these contracts and everything, and based on how big this game is, so many people are hyped up for this game. I don't believe Sony, number one, will want to make sure this contract stays and they want to keep the time release. So no one's going to back out of the deal. I I'm saying all this to say that if it's this is the case, this and it still has a limited exclusive exclusivity, I believe the best launch window is during the summer, with a higher chance at mid to late summer. And the reasoning is that with the game being delayed and the lack in the next-gen consoles, with them being very still hard to find, they will make sure it's out on all platforms and available for people to have a higher chance to play with the next-gen graphics for the holidays to max their sales. Also, late summer makes sense due to school starting not too long afterwards or being around the start of school and allowing children and other and teenagers alike to spread the game by word of mouth. This would allow the game to be exclusive to PC and PlayStation for three months. And then November or October Halloween release on Xbox. This would allow a period for the game to be exclusive, while allowing the Xbox players to get hands on the game before and during the holidays. So, like, for example, Christmas time and any of the other holidays would allow more sales, like Black Friday, those kind of times. So when do you think this game will release? Do you think it will be in the late spring or in the early summer? So what do you think? Comment down below your thoughts. Be sure to like the video and subscribe if you're new. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.